Martin Luther was born November 10th, 1483, and died February 18th, 1546. A strong believer in the necessity of reformation in the Catholic Church, he believed that salvation was achieved only through the grace of God. He wrote the 95 Theses and nailed them to the door of a church in Wittenberg. He believed that all people had vocations. He was greatly opposed to the corruption of the church, especially the sale of indulgences. His belief in justification by faith is one of the main forces behind the Protestant Reformation. Desiderius Erasmus was born on October 28, 1466, and died July 12, 1536. He was a Dutch humanist and was sometimes referred to as Erasmus of Rotterdam. He, like Martin Luther, saw the corruption within the Catholic Church and realized that Reformation was needed. However, he believed that the Reformation was necessary within the Catholic Church rather than a complete separation. He believed that people had free will and that they achieved salvation by doing good deeds. And this is what would have happened if Martin Luther and Erasmus had met. Luther, Erasmus, nice to see you here. Oh, I, you know, I was doing some reading and I uh, happened to come across some books that you wrote. And I must say, Praise of Folly. What a magnificent piece. Thank you. However, your book on the freedom of will, I must say, is Boulder Dash. Mm. And why is that, Luther? Well, you see, we gain salvation not through good deeds, but by the salvation of God alone, Justifi justification by faith as I wrote in my book, On the Bondage of Will. The Bondage of Will. Wasn't that to counter my book on the freedom of will? That was, that was completely on purpose, wasn't it? Absolutely. Oh. Well, I heard that you want to start a new church? A separation, that is? Yes. We're both reformers. We know the Catholic Church is far too corrupt. We need to separate. We can't stay with it. It's beyond Reformation. We should create a completely new church. Luther, this new church will gain followers, no doubt. The Catholic Church is very corrupt. However, this church that you're going to create, the Catholics will not allow. Your followers will be persecuted. Hundreds of thousands of innocent civilians that decided to switch from their church to your church will be killed. Massacres will happen. Genocide. And you're blinded just to seek the truth? It's the only way to save millions from purgatory. You will join me, won't you? No, Luther. I won't join you. Oh. Then you shall die, heathen!